Wife, if you will. Go for it, if you will. You're in the wrong office. Then. Oh, hallelujah. We hope and pray that you as deacons of Jesus Christ will keep our trust. You know, let's go for that. I got deacons ought to all listen. Deacons should never be late to church. Don't listen. This ain't no play play stuff. Ordination of a deacon is equal to an elder. Because an ordained deacon can serve communion, they can lay hands, they should administer when the pastor's not there. So how in the world you will be a deacon and the pastor out and you can't go to church? When the deacon miss church, they should call and inform the pastor, not the wife, not the daughter, the sister, the brother, the uncle. They call and ask for permission from their pastor. No show mean no deacon. No show mean you ought to be fired from the deaconship. You don't call yourself the deacon. Deacon is appointed by the pastor. So the pastor can appoint and the pastor can unappoint. You're not a deacon for life. Oh, hallelujah. God don't call him. He said, choose you seven men. So if by any chance the person who Commission you to be the, the deacon, or who recommended you to the bishop to be the deacon, which is your local pastor, they have the right to take you right down as a deacon. Amen. Hallelujah. So today, what shall I hear from the ordination committee? You belong to the church. I don't know what he meant for your pastor. But a back bill is. This is our deaconship dress. When he clears the obstacle service, I this is mine. You ain't this with us. Deacons wear arms. This is the correct deacon's attire. Holy brethren, saints of God, we bring you in God these deacons. Recommended by the ordination board to be ordained. Do you trust that you are truly called and anointed by the Lord to live right and that the trust that your pastor has entrusted in you to be a deacon, that you are truly will be faithful to that office? to those in need through your kindness, through your call, through your visitation on behalf of the church and calling to a fourth greater discipleship as an humble disciple of Jesus Christ. If so, answer, I will and I am committed. provide an upright example by your life, your words, your attitude, your behavior, and your family life that will point others to Christ by living holy. And so everybody in unison, I will. I will. I will. There are people you have, these people have been elected 
you've heard their declaration of their readiness to serve in the office of a deacon. I ask you, the church, to declare your affirmation with me. Repeat after me, we are not sufficient. People, we trust they are worthy to God be glory, all right? We, we are not sufficient in ourselves. Our strength comes from God. Do you trust that these people are by the grace of God worthy to be installed as a hard deacon and the people shall say? We do. We do. All the bishops don't have a people. Repeat after me, we trust they are worthy. We trust they are worthy. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. Hallelujah. I'll go. Of the Lord's church. Clap your hands, brother. You may be seated. 